Thank oh, you yeah. so much. You guys have a great day. Yeah, you too. Good morning. I honestly don't know why I'm vlogging today. <laughs> Other than the fact that I plan to vlog today. Wow, this is hitting me a lot harder than I thought it was going to. Yesterday was a really hard day. Yesterday, we, um, as a school, found out that one of the students here passed away due to medical reasons. And it's not like it's the first time that there's been um, a student who's passed away, either like a current or um, past student this time was different for me because it was one of mine. That was the first time. No one prepares you for that when you're going through like all your college prep and every, like no one prepares you. for the heartbreak that you feel when you lose one of your students. And of course, when I found out, I, you know, couldn't say anything and I didn't really want any of my students to know at that point because I wasn't supposed to tell them. And then even when I read the statement that we had to read, you know, I, uh, I struggled a little bit for sure, but, you know, I did my best to get through it without crying or any emotion because, you know, they need teachers to be strong. And so I did, and I didn't start crying until I got home. Then I really started crying when I got to my parents' house because we were gonna go, and we still did. We went and saw the Little Mermaid, me, my sister, and my dad. And I got home and I just, I started sobbing. No one prepares you for that. And I thought like I'd be fine, you know, like, I was like, I'll be upset, but I'll be fine. And then I walked into my classroom and it just hit, it all just hit me again. <laughs> and I didn't sleep very well last night because of allergies, so I'm tired and emotional. <sighs> and then of course it made me start thinking like, about different things and different people. It's just like how you know, you never know when it's the last time you're going to talk to somebody. But we're here. I don't know, once my students get here, I'll be fine. Because I have to be, I have to be strong for them. I'm not sure why I'm vlogging, but we are. It's Tuesday. Um, graduation is tonight, so, you know, that'll be bittersweet for me. I got human bean because it was just a lot of work to get out of the house today. Um, I straightened my hair because I want to look presentable for graduation. I brought my makeup with me. I figured I would do it. I went and got a croissant, mostly because I wanted a croissant on Sunday. And so I went to Panera. Probably one of the worst croissants I've ever had in my entire life. It was probably, it was probably a croissant from the day before, if we're being honest. So that craving was not satisfied. This is doing the job for sure. Today's gonna be rough. It's gonna be rough. And you know, 
It just seems fitting. <laughs> because this time last year, there was a lot that happened um, to start. My dog passed away. Um, almost, I think tomorrow might be the year of that. And then the week after I got dumped for the first time by my ex. Yeah, it just feels like this is the trend. End of this end of the school year, something tragic has to happen in my life. And the sad part, I feel safe saying this here because I'm fairly confident he doesn't watch these videos, but when they told me was the first person I wanted to reach out to. He was the first person I wanted to call. But I had to stop myself because he's not a part of my life anymore. And that, that's really hard. And yesterday really showed that. All I know is that yesterday was really hard and Today might be harder. We'll see. I need to get ready for the day. Eat. And try to compose myself. Like my YouTube channel cover says, unapologetically me. This is me. Super emotional. Hopefully the vlog only goes up from here. Okay, so I'm done with my creative meeting for church and it's five o'clock. I don't have to be at graduation until six and I'm at school and I don't really feel like going home and then having to drive back and find parking. So I might just hang out. Today was an okay day. Definitely, you know, some sad moments um, not that I like cried or anything, just because I've been around kids pretty much all day. But there were definitely some sad moments. It's, you can feel it in like the atmosphere. You can just kind of feel that it's still very present. And I talked with a few of my students today um, and a lot of them are still really, really impacted by this. So it's gonna take a while. Graduation's gonna be interesting for sure, but it wasn't a bad day, so that's good at least.